Second leg, purse of $30,000. The run gate, and the gate is rolling. And they're off. Nutmegs Maya sprints out. Looks for the early lead. A list also left well from in between horses and home stake. Is away quickly from along the inside as they race into the opening turn. And Nutmegs Maya and Chris Page looking for the early lead. A list away well from along the inside second. Talk it up is also in the action early. Still part of the outside third. Home stake away in fourth. Kenzie's Beach Boy found a spot in fifth in front of Duel in the Sun. Came away sixth. Soda Pop is seventh in front of Derby Dillon eighth. It's a length and a half to Jude Hall, who races from ninth. Blatantly best is tenth in the early going. And Summons is the trailer through an opening quarter of 28 seconds even. And talk it up, the 46-1 to long shot was up to take over. But now faces pressure from Homestake and Shetler, who are up on the outside and look for the top. Nutmegs Maya now off the top pair in third. A-list remains along the inside fourth. Kenzie's Beach Boy is fifth as Duel in the Sun moves to the outside sixth. Soda Pop shoots the gap in seventh. They were past the half 55 and three and now a list is up to apply pressure to home stake talk it up now back along the inside third kenzie's beach boy is towed into it perfectly second over from fourth with three eighths of a mile to go duel in the sun is up on the outside third over from fifth nutmegs maya nowhere to go from sixth derby dillon is fourth over from seventh blatantly best moves into eighth three wide but still has plenty of work to do their past three quarters and one 24 and two home stake is given the cold shoulder to a list kenzie's beach boy now moves up at the center of the track talk it up shakes loose late duel in the sun though moves up down the center of the track blatantly best up on the far outside down to the two canvas colts it's duel in the sun blatantly best rough gated and makes a break blatantly best off stride so duel in the sun is going to sprint clear and win it easily talk it up appeared to hold second it was tight for third maybe jude hall derry dillon was right there blatantly best off stride as well 153 flat Judges have posted a six duel in the sun, the unofficial winner from tonight's 10th race. In the photograph, number nine, talk it up, was second. Number eight, blatantly best, finished third, but is the subject of a judge's inquiry. Possible violation of the breaking rule. Once again, number eight, blatantly best, finished third, but is under a judge's inquiry right now. Possible violation of the breaking rule. Number seven, Jude Hall on the board in fourth. Six, nine, eight, seven. Once again, remains unofficial on the board. Judge's inquiry concerning number eight, blatantly best. Returning track side, number six, Duel in the Sun. John Budenchain is the trainer.
Peter Wren sweeps both of the freshman pacing legs tonight. Duel in the Sun is owned by the VIP Internet Stable, LLC, Piscataway, New Jersey, and William Wiswell of Elkhorn, Wisconsin. Duel in the Sun is a two-year-old bay gelding by Cam Best out of the Western Hanover Mayor Magical Western. Duel in the Sun, a winner for the third time and only hits sixth career start. He wins it in a lifetime best performance this evening, 153 flat. Four number six, Duel in the Sun. And off the pace rally, change of tactics this evening. Off at odds of seven to two. Once again, the judges' inquiry continues concerning number eight, blatantly best, the unofficial third place finisher. Fans, your attention, please. The judges have determined that number eight blatantly best was not in violation of the breaking rule. Results will stand as posted. Six, nine, eight, seven remains on the board unofficial in race 10.